This is WYMT Mountain Sports, your home for the Kentucky Wildcats and local high school sports. Ten years is how long it has been since Kentucky and Cincinnati played on the hardwood. That is until this afternoon's meeting in the NCAA tournament. Associate head coach Larry Davis and Cincinnati hoping to end the season for John Calipari and the Kentucky Wildcats. This game had a slow start for both teams, but this play brought some excitement. Tyler Eulis to Willie Cauley Stein. We're all tied up a little bit early, but the Bearcats answer at the other end. Jermaine Sanders, the wide open three, gives the lead back to Cincinnati. Kentucky made just two three-pointers in the first half. Here's one of them. Aaron Harrison ties the game back up at 13 apiece, but what do the Bearcats do? They respond. Kevin Johnson from straight away, Kentucky up one. Trey Lyles was a mismatch all game for Cincinnati. Gets around the defender, slams at home, puts Kentucky up one. And the Wildcats are going back to the Sweet 16. They beat Cincinnati 64-51 in Louisville. Our own Tanner Hesterberg is covering the Cats and joins us now with more. Tanner? Well, Josh, good afternoon from a gorgeous day here in downtown Louisville. Kentucky fans still coming out of the KFC Yum Center as the Cats are victorious today over Cincinnati. Moving on to the Sweet 16, the word everyone is using to describe this game, and rightfully so, Physical. Cincinnati made it a very ugly game from the beginning. Very physical with Kentucky, both underneath the basket as things got a little chippy towards uh, about the middle part of the second half. But in the end, Kentucky pulls away for the victory. Here's what some of the UC players and their associate head coach had to say after the game. I think we did a good job in the first half. And, um, and I, I think we was in the game, and we just we just made a couple million errors that we need to fix. But I think we I think we, we played real physical with them, and um, I, we're gonna be back here next year. Um, I don't think they handled our physicality very well throughout the game. Uh, mental lapses that happened on the offensive end is why we lost the game. It, it wasn't nothing that they did. I think our turnovers. We had a couple turnovers in a row. That was the big momentum swing in the game. I mean, and you know. They had a few dunks, not what they normally have, but um, I think the turnovers deflated us more than, than the dunk did. We, you know, we knew that they were. A big game for Trey Lyles for Kentucky, 11 points to go along with 11 rebounds, and then for the Cats, nine blocks as a team as Cincinnati just couldn't get anything close to the rim the whole game, and Kentucky moves on to the Sweet 16. I'll have much more on the Cats win today coming up tonight on Sports Overtime. But for now, reporting live in downtown Louisville, Tanner Hesterberg, WYMT Mountain Sports. Thank you, Tanner. The Cats now await the winner of tomorrow's game between West Virginia and Maryland. The Kentucky women will try for their fourth consecutive Sweet 16 Sunday afternoon when they host the Dayton Flyers. The Wildcats advanced rather easily past Tennessee State 97-52, placing six players in double figures. The Flyers beat Iowa State in round 178-66, and both head coaches say at this point in the season, you cannot worry too much about the opponent, but rather focus on yourself. Amber Dean is a much better player. You know, Kelly Austria is a much better player. Um, so, you know, and our, our bigs are big, and, and they can run, and they're athletic. And uh, so, you know, like I said, I... I think we're a very different team. We're a more mature team, more confident team. And, and uh, you know, if we can do what we do and, and, and don't get disrupted, and, and uh, I think, you know, it's going to be a great game. Look at what you don't have time to cover every single thing that they do, so you better uh, be really focused on what you do real well. And, um, you know, we've been able to do that over the, over the years, and, and I'm – We'll stress that to this particular team. We just need to uh, do the things that we do well and try to find a way to win the game by one point and, and keep advancing. You just that's that's the mentality right now. Uh, no distractions for them, for for our players. Just make sure they're focused, uh, so their minds can understand their responsibility in the game and then go out and execute. That's our mantra right now. So.